I'm aboard this amazing research and filming ship called the Aleutia. It's equipped with two deep diving submersibles. There's one behind me, the Triton, and behind that is the Deep Rover, a two-man submarine. Both subs are 1,000 meter rated. We probably on board the ship do the most 1,000 meter diving in the world. We were filming from two submersibles at a time. And it is amazing, uh, and it, but it's a challenge. We are just about to enter the rim of the blue hole now. Roger. Uh, blue hole is basically a cave that forms in a carbonate platform or limestone. When sea level was lower, the rainwater was slightly acidic and it actually dissolves that limestone, forms this cave. You've got to coordinate on the bottom, at depth, two submersibles. And I'm filming our scientist and our post. Uh, visibility at generous 10 meters, both lights on, lights off. Over. Right now we're in the Aleutia's mission control room. Uh, this is where they communicate with the subs. Okay, uh, when you're happy, Paul would like to try the conversation shot stationary. We spent a lot of time coordinating shots of the sub passing overhead and underneath and going along the ridge. Roger that. I'm just uh, trying to give uh, the camera more of a starboard. The three-man sub with our cast had to come up three times and change members. That was incredible. My submarine, the two-man submarine, we stayed down the whole time. So we stayed down six hours <laughs> on the bottom. And the six hours went fast, but you're also curled up in a little small space. And so by the end of six hours, you realize, I really need to stretch my legs. Really, really good. Yeah, really good. And that's the longest I've ever been in a sub. Apparently, on that day, you know, we were the first subs, or two subs, to go to the bottom of a blue hole uh, in the Bahamas. So, it's pretty cool.